From rampant fraud to delayed payments, we've been tracking issues in Arizona's unemployment system for more than a year, and now we've learned there are some Arizonans still not getting paid what they're owed, even after a ruling in their favor. So three on your side, Susan Campbell has all the details. Susan. Yeah, DES didn't tell us how many unemployment cases went to adjudication, but they say some of them are complicated. And even after a judge's ruling, payment could be delayed. For one man in Globe, he's waiting on $14,000. They owe me a little over $14,000. Arizona owes Derek Billingsley a lot of money. It's all unemployment benefits dating back months. I received benefits until June, the second week of June. And then they stopped and said that, uh, it was under review for potential fraud. Months ago, the Department of Economic Security said Derek didn't qualify for unemployment. He filed an appeal and an adjudicator ruled in his favor. It was definitely a sense of relief. But Derek says he's still waiting for his money to be deposited. On his account, all those payments say in progress. Basically, I'm just completely in the dark about what's going on. Like nobody seems to have any answers for me. We asked DES why Derek's still waiting for his money. They couldn't talk to us about a specific case. DES says most cases that go through adjudication are processed within a few days, but said some issues are determined during the appeals process that can result in a claim being held until those issues can be reviewed and resolved. Adding, we understand the tremendous need for assistance, and we appreciate the patience of individuals with unique and nuanced cases. Derek says after so many months, his patience is wearing thin. I just have to get paid, actually. I could really use the money. DES says even if you're waiting on payments, you should continue to file your weekly claims. Now, after we flagged Derek's case for DES, he says he got a call from the agency and is expecting his payment soon. I'm sure it's frustrating. Susan, thank you.